I'm Westy, I'm a seasoned Battlefield player, and it's fallen to me to take these four Battlefield 1 novices from corporals to generals. Whoa! I've got this guy, he's mine. And the sniper over here, get him, get him with your sword. Bomber, bomber! Whoa, tank, tank! Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go around behind him. Boom, that was a shot. Welcome to Battlefield Academy. All right, guys, welcome to Battlefield Academy. You all know why you're here. You're not very good at Battlefield, and you need to get better. Oh, no. Oh, my God, this is all going badly. There's a tank. Oh, this is all going badly. Go on! Take the Run. shot, buddy! Yes! Oh, I hit it. Just starting to take it, guys. Support, uh, I need one more kill for it. Yes. Kill him! Kill him! Yeah. Kill him. Oh, wait, you. oh, get him with the melee! Get him! One point, one point, let's go! No, no, we won! Yay! Yay! Phew! Just. That went surprisingly <laughs> well. We did okay. I came bottom in the scoreboard, which is to be expected, I imagine. Mayhem, drama, action. It was it, it was it was a great experience. It actually wasn't as horrific as I thought it might be. Highlight though has to be that kind of fight at F, because there was just grenades going on, it was chaotic, it was crazy, it's everything you come to expect from Battlefield. So Westy has been really good, although I kind of imagined him being sterner. I just hope he doesn't be too harsh on me. And so I think he'll be a bit mean when I make mistakes. Easy. You've got on the horse's slipstream, innit? With the assault kit, you've got uh, submachine guns. The best thing you can do with those is just literally hold down the trigger and keep firing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna need a lot of lessons, Westy. <laughs> Let's get F. Let's get F. So what you could do here is like if you could get the spotting flare out and like there's some three on the keyboard and then just fire I've it up got in the my, air. I've got my flash. Woo! They're all on fire over there. <laughs> so if you throw bandages, you just have to tap Q and it will throw bandages. Out. Oh Q! So Learning just, just... is fun. Well, I was really happy in general. Uh, I saw some big improvements in infantry play. That's what we kind of focused on in that first game. 22 damage, 44 Yay! damage, and it's down. We worked better as a squad. We were communicating a lot more, shouting at each other. Whatever the communication is, it's just sometimes important to tell people. There's loads of them at sea now. Hey, man. I'm going Mark. We won the match, we communicate effectively, we all kind of coalesce to the same goal. If someone fell down, the other one picked them up. And you can just see how a little bit of, uh, of knowledge, a bit of skill and a lot of communication can really help to make us uh, a better Battlefield squad. We're all, like, we're all focused, we're all going from one place to another. As soon as we've done one task, we know what we're doing next. We're all together, it's great. We worked so much better as a team. We were sticking together, we were giving each other ammo, health. I was being able to pick up some really nice shots, which I was really happy with. There was this one section where I was like, what, what is going on? I was picking up kills all over the place. Oh my god, that was a shot! In the first game, we were a bit like, uh, I guess I should go over here, and I, I guess a tactic would be to run towards this building, but, but now I'm like, you know, partially because I know the map, but also because I know the, the best way to attack certain points because of Wesley's teachings. So, yeah, definite improvement. third person to line up your shot and then switch to first person when you're about to shoot. Whoa, yep. pull up, pull, pull up. up. You can just literally ride past your teammates and then you can just drop health and ammo straight away. Clever girl from the side. I'm 
really impressed with, with what they've achieved so far. We're working really, really well as a squad together and that's probably the most important thing, regardless of what their skill level is. Being able to work with someone else is the most important thing because if you're talking to somebody, maybe they can help you with something that you're not, not, not that good at. And in Battlefield, that is so important because you've got a defined role, your friend's got a different defined role. If you work together, most of the time you can achieve the goal that you want. I think come that live stream, I don't think we're going to have a problem. We're coming up against public players, and yes, there's some really good players out there, but we've got the squad play nailed down now. They've all got their roles. They all know what they're supposed to do. As long as we work as a team, the public just don't stand a chance. I think they'll be absolutely fine when they come to the live stream. Play it first with EA Access.